time here. Wind, rain or shine. Except on Sundays. Every last one of these garages is like family to me. I know what is in every last one of them. And I know who owns them. And I know what is in them. I'm a wee metal baby and I look after the garages. Basically that's my job. There are two main reasons. One, I need to know what's inside. Two, I need to know who owns them. And three, if they're secure. I do this job because, well, I live in a local area and I like to look after my local area. I, I like to know what's going on and what is actually inside these garages. So that's why I am the garage checker. Uh, I hear, I heard it, um, well, um, I was walking past these garages one day and I noticed that nobody was checking the garages. So I thought that's a job which needs to be done. So I did it. Well, I need to know what is in every last one of these garages. It's not private if it is chemicals or bombs or faulty merchandise. I was um, checking these um, garages one day and um, I um, just so happened to hear a noise coming from one of the garages. So I went, right, bolt cutters, get a lock. So um, I opened it up and um, there was about uh, hundreds of thousands of, uh, of um, live animals inside. I was like, well, this is not good. This is not fair. These animals deserve to be free. So um, what I did is I, um, I set them free all over, um, all over the local um, area. Well, uh, some of them were dangerous creatures like boa constrictors and the snakes. But um, I thought rather than being crabbed in that space, they need to be freed. I mean, uh, there was plenty of deaths, but uh, unfortunately the animals needed to be killed when they were captured. But that little bit of freedom they had, it made me feel so good inside. Unfortunately, he is, um, he's um, absconded and I'm currently in Costa del Sol. But um, I have a message for him that I will find him. Garage 13 is free for him. I know where you are. So is this your battleground? Yes, um, this is my domain. It's like, this is where I'm the man in charge. Every one of these garages, I know intimately. I know every square inch of these garages, especially number 13. After that drugs bust, I didn't owe nine. What was the drugs bust? Ah, uh, well, we actually found um, cartons upon cartons of max strength cold and flu tablets. Very dangerous stuff. Time for another routine check on the garages. Uh, what the bloody hell is going on here? Some prize numpty has parked my car right outside number 13. People are not allowed to do that. No. Thing. They do need to marry Cray. I'll have this for the records. There you go. Oh, oh. 
Time for another um, routine check. I normally do these um, every two days, but um, I was a bit suspicious of that car um, yesterday, so I thought I'm gonna come the next day. Um, and um, I was a bit suspicious of one of the um, one of the um, garages. What happened to the car? Well, uh, let's just see. It's a bit wet. Right. So what's made you suspicious? Well, uh, I couldn't quite see into one of the garages yesterday. So, um, and uh, plus, there's a bit of a, bit of a hum, bit of a hum in the air. The light does not quite smell right. That one. Out, but uh, it'd be a last resort to actually go inside. But um, can't quite see inside. Might have to get inside that. Oh, I check you. I left my boat cause on my last job I did. Ah. Uh, they were good boat cars as well. Ah, idea. Got some tools for an old job. This will do just a trick to get the door open. That should do it. Yeah. 